How do I practice the art of momentum? What are the issues around about it? How do I, in spite of my very tight schedule, throw out a plan, map it out, and achieve maximum success? How do I maximize outcomes and output? Given the resources at my disposal to ensure that there's no waste, resources are maximally utilized to drive home the objective. And at the end of the day, there's reward for the critical stakeholders where even before you begin it, you know what you want to do, where you are going, and can measure over time the processes and procedures so that when you get there, you will know what it will cost you to also get there will not be lost in the hiding, even for you. These are all the issues that are so germane on the question of momentum. Momentum can be a war, if you don't know about it, a war to fight, battle to fight. It can also be a game to play and you catch fun with it, despite your very busy and tasking. So I want you to know that the idea in this class is to help you to play the game and not to fight the war. When you okay. fight the war of momentum, you are the one who will lose because you will put in so much and get in so little. You are likely going to run over so many things you, you can actually have the design with you, but the details in the design, so many loopholes, so many lapses, and you will wonder, ah, did it type plan? So what happened? That's a fact about momentum. It's both an art and also a science. It is a science because when you follow the procedure and the method and the processes that are laid down, you get the result. It is an art because following procedure and not carrying it out physically, the art aspect will not play out what we want you will discover it is from the word moment. We get the word yes. momentum. So momentum says, how well are you handling your moment by moment analysis? To be able to maintain focus, fine tune until you are fulfilled in your role. So it's a moment by moment aggregation. How you are playing it, how well you are playing it, and getting what you want per moment. Where you are not okay. tired, where you are just go to go, and you get going at the same time. That is your moment. Okay. It is the ability to start and finish within a record time so that at the end of the day, you achieve your self goal and objective. So I say momentum and the world around it 
it is knowing and reckoning with a system and procedure. Momentum will be an easy work, sir. If there is a system on ground. Okay. Say, so, okay, after this, it, it will remain this and that and this. In a system, you have a procedure. So say, okay, this system, this is how it works. It works this way, it works that way. Hmm? Where yes. it is describable by anybody who sets it, you are the one who will sit down and set it out so that even you will not break it. Anybody who breaks it, the system will collapse. When a system is in place, a sentiment has no way. Because even you, if you don't follow it, it won't answer you. <laughs> that is the issue with momentum. It thrives so well where there is a system. That is why anybody working with you, one of the critical things they first must understand is what they are coming to do and how to do it. So that they know what it is, how it is, and then the expectation on them, the demand placed on them within a record time, where timelines and deadlines are equally important. Timeline says, with this, this moment and that moment, we expect you to get this for us. Within two months, within three months, get this for us. And at the end of six months, this is what we want to see. Very vital. That is momentum. Hey, Jomo. So whenever the issue of momentum comes to the fore, we want to ask you, how do you allow things to go by, by the order and decorum, from start to finish? And one thing that can help you, sir, in this, is such an idea where, get it to bury, you plan it. We say, well, this thing, this is the concept. I want to start it from here and end it here. Not just talking it. You sit down with it, analyze it, and then look at what is going to take. Process by process procedure by procedure, detail by detail, before you even start it. You know that yes, as also time, this is where it will hit. It might look uh, a bit uh, clumsy at first, but at the end of the day, the means will justify the end. At the end, we also justify the means. It may first appear to you as if you are wasting time. But those are the de defining times that shows you the level of success you are going to achieve at the end of the day. So many people don't like it because they felt it's time wasting. Meanwhile, that is actually the meat of the gist. And what tells you whether you are doing it right or not? So what I will say, it is very vital. You allow Dikuro, you allow order, and then you put reward 
and sanction. Whoever does it right has also died. I'm not hearing you, brother. You are not hearing me again. Yes, you say it is important that I put. I say, people like what me did now. As okay, uh, it is important that I, I put. Uh, as okay, it might look as if it's time wasting, but uh, uh, it is the meat of the matter. It be, uh, uh, that is where I see uh, the book burning. I said many people don't like doing it because they felt it is time wasting. Meanwhile, that is really where the life of a project is. The ability to work it out from the word go and plan it in your mind and see the various aspects of it before you even run it. So that whoever missed the target, get reward, get rewarded. And whoever flouts it, get sanctioned accordingly. So that people can be motivated to perform, whether you are there or not. One thing with momentum is that whether you are there or not, the system put in place captures everybody through what we call structure. It's one thing to create a system, sir, is another thing for the system to have a structure that identifies the various work of individuals so that there will be no effort duplication or labor running into each other, overlapping, we call it, because it's well structured. And the reporting lines we call me. Oh, so 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 is reporting to so 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 is getting the report from so 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 and so. Flow we call me. Just like human body. Now look at human body. Do you know, sir? Whether we are awake or we are asleep, all our body functions, they keep working. There's personal momentum in our human bodies. We see it work over time. You are sleeping, you are awake, your body gains momentum. Even when you are tired, internal functions still go on, achieving it in and performing because the systems, the organs, everyone doing his own bit in order to contribute to the whole growth and development of the body. So anytime you want to understand momentum, sir, look at your human physiology, the way it works. Kidney will never do the work of a liver. Liver will never do the work of spleen or heart. Everybody doing his own work and getting results as at when do and giving it to the other to continue in the process. That's why the Bible in Isaiah says, the carpenter encouraged the ghostsmith. And he that smoted with the anvil, say it is ready for soldiering. That is momentum. Where structures and systems play very critical role in ensuring that things get done. So where this is non-existent, they work with cripple on one person. 
it can look like a big company, yet it will be running on one single individual who, when he has not moved, nothing moves. Who, when he has not said something, everybody is handicapped. We don't know what to do. Which is the current situation you are going through now. But that's why I felt, let me give you this lecture first, and then you will now look at your work in the light of it. To say, okay, Fami, what is the system on ground? Okay, uh, fishery. What is the whole procedure? Short term, intermediate, and long term. Who is doing what? What is the gestation period? We want to be able to look at all of this before they even start. So that we don't do trial and error with funds. Eh? You just say, okay, assuming I went to bank to borrow money, will I be able to do trial and error with it? No. And interest will be going on and all other expenses. So that's why the popular maxim says, when you don't plan, you whoever fail to plan is planning to fail. And we don't want to fail. So we plan. So it's part of our planning. Where we plan, we get things done easily. Momentum take its toll. So Momentum, sir, is not a freelancer. When you say momentum, it is working on something. Now look at the railway, train. Once you start up a play, it's a train, eh, upon its rail, as you fire for the first time, the train gain momentum, and it can keep going on no, without stopping. And when the train is going to stop, it cannot just stop at once, just like a airplane too. As soon as it lifted off the uh, uh, amid air, it gains momentum and keep flying at an altitude so high and maintain its speed uniformly and keep going until it's going to land. They don't have library, and yet it keeps moving and moving and moving, never stopping amid scare. That is it. So, very vital. So, in momentum, sir, attention is given to even the minutest details of the process. Every part works. When one part is not working, we quickly fix it because it's going to affect the other part. So we ensure that attention is given to minutest details and the design we have on ground for fit and functioning. We don't call it momentum, sir, when there is nothing like an expectation on ground. And it's not momentum because it is your expectation that will drive the agenda you have set. So where there's no go post, it's difficult to stop, to score. <laughs> we just play row row like that because no go post. But you gain momentum for the fact that there's a go post that every one of us is targeting. There is a speed required for everyone is needing to put. So that at the end of the day, we all score goals uniformly. So momentum, therefore, is a lesser point attention to what matters. Given all the materials required, for sustainability until a process is complete. That is momentum, until a process is complete. 
it is not halfway. Does that mean there would be no issues dropping off as strenuous issues? There would be. But the rule of momentum says immediately fix it. Don't leave it. Don't give excuse. See what can be done in the short run and get it fixed for continuity. So momentum says concept, construction, comprehension, continuity, multi completion. Sorry, sir. Can you come again, sir? <laughs> momentum in its face says one what is the concept what is the concept you get the concept okay construct it just like an architect you tell an architect oh this is the type of house i want he mm. now goes to the drawing board and construct it on paper and draw it for you Okay. From construction, what do you go into? You go into comprehension. Okay, okay, by so so time, I want this, I want that. You comprehend it yourself before you begin it, sir. Otherwise, momentum will not work. From comprehension now, you look at things you have to put in for continuity. Assuming so so and so happen. Eh? What are the options B? What can we easily follow upon? Continuity. Mm -hmm. And then from continuity, sir, you start targeting completion. Those are the stages. What do we need? How do we want to see it when we complete it? So that when it is completed, everybody will know that yes. We completed it. Not only the leader we know, everybody, because we have already stressed it out for everybody to see. That's why even the Bible in Habakkuk says, write the vision. Make it plain upon tables that he may roar, that he does it. That is another word for momentum there. That people cannot run when they cannot read it. And people cannot read it until you write it. Those are the five stages I have just broken down in corporate language. What is the concept? How did you conceive it? What do you want? Why are you into fishery? What is the concept about fishery? So that I will drive the objective. Then how do you want to construct it? Okay, you want it in a uh, Bodija so large and all that because Bodija has the strategic market or what? You think of the questions around construction. If you forget anything, don't forget these five steps I'm giving you, sir, on momentum. Because those are the things that will generate questions for you, for you to be able to plan where. Idea only money for business. Idea and money for books, for books. Why? You are not just selling books because you like books. No, but because it is marketable and then solving problems. And you want to use it to solve problems and then through it, create resources for yourself. So the concept, then how do we construct it? Okay, let's construct it this way in three places in Ibadan because they are very strategic area for books. Oh, UI, Agbuwo, Bodija, whatever. And these are still planning you. You have not even put anything on ground. Eh? You are running it through and through. And then after construction, you comprehend it. So that when you are explaining to people who run with you, actually, yeah, one or that that we okay, that means from here to this day and to that state, we get it done. From construction, 
you now put in feeders and fillers for continuity, okay? like feedback mechanism. Okay, when you say so, 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 and so, let us know. Okay, when you go through hitches and you find difficulty, tell us. People will now know what to do. There will be no hide and seek game. There will be seamless communication. Eh? So yes, after, after continuity is communication. And then from there, you hit completion. Then we go stage this one year, let the money procedure of one leg. There's none of the business you are doing, Mr. Lurity, that we cannot weigh in the light of this. So the assignment I'm going to give you is that. Weigh fishery, weigh your family, weigh your book, weigh your philanthropy in all of this light. Concept, construction. I ask yourself the question, what did I do about construction? I about comprehension. It's not let me to understand it. I about my wife. I about people who are working so close to me on this. Comprehension. On comprehension, what are the things we put in for continuity? And then I about communication. What are the method of communication? To bring in a, a therapist like me to explain further to people for you to show them how it can work and motivate them for you. It's part of your communication strategy. And before you know it, you are hitting completion. So book by one more, you know many procedures, processes, so that, sir, even when your work grows suddenly, you just bring that template on it. I say, yes, I'm bringing this template. It will work. It will work for it will work for book. It will work for any other thing. Even when you are creating new things. So feedback way. As these things grow and grow, you now begin to appoint what we call managers. They can be virtual, they can be real. You now say, okay, this is the manager in charge of so and so. What will they be managing, sir? Otherwise, they'll be redundant. They'll be managing these processes and feeding you. Ecomatic report me. Eric, oh, what is of I want to look my generator. Report. Ah, Professor, and so come and explain. Mr. So and so, why is the process uh, breached in this level and that level? Is it communication problem, continuity problem, or conception problem, or, continue, or uh, completion? So that you now know what to fix, what to talk. And then your talk will be minimal. You won't go through overall and then just close it because it's not bringing money. Why is it not bringing money? <laughs> we look at eh, the procedure that is on ground for momentum and quickly fix it. So, and that is what managers do. Your work will be growing and yet we are having more free time. And it's not what you alone can do, sir. So okay. the assignment I want to give you now is to put this template on all these various work of yours so that you discover yeah, so that. what are, how do i know the processes that are involved in each of these this stages uh, how do i know this the processes that are involved in each of these uh, stages that is the phase two of this lecture i need to get you to understand first by the time you now put all of them and say, okay, this is what I know about my fishery. This is the concept about it. I will say, hey, okay, you mean this and this. I will now broaden it for you so that you yourself will have a better light 
and I will cast your concept corporately for you. That will uh, that will turn it to a commercial venture. Then you say, okay, uh, doctor, this is what I constructed. I will say, yeah, Mr. Luranti, with this kind of concept, don't you think we can construct it this way and that way, even if it will make you invest in more in this area? We will discuss it and know that that one is set. And then the people who work around construction, we give them dead timelines, deadlines, and all of that. Then we look at uh, continuity and then communication. What is the line of communication between superiors and the uh, colleagues and the uh, 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 subordinates? Yeah? It's not just that anybody is working and they are all waiting for you and looking up to you. No, they have superiors who supervises, monitors, and ensure that things are done. I have to call a pay okay or manager is a any so that a nickel sorry air command by report is a demand. Okay, I have to communication. How do you communicate with what? You know, there are communication gadgets now that are very inexpensive that some of these uh, communication folks uses. How do they do it? They can just give you a line, dedicated line, customized for your staff alone. If you are 100 or 150, everybody will have that uh, access. And it will be so cheap so that anybody can reach anybody within a short time. Then, where you are setting Zoom group. Zoom or WhatsApp group, you also do that one. You create a template for people to complain and all of that. And then the work will be going on. We'll also create that. Why are we doing that? It will take up stress from you. Then you can rest where you can sleep. You can even go and play golf. <laughs> it's a <hard> them <laughs> Or you'll be looking and checking his report. Eh? Even the report they are submitting, we also have timelines. So you have anybody who does not submit report, you hold the manager responsible. Not you talking to one uh, client who, who is not reporting and you are there, come to your law. No. You hold the manager. Manager, what happened? Manager will say, oh, I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry, sir. He will be the one running around for his client. <laughs> Well, the way it is on Grand Press and Lisa, you are the one talking to clerk, talking to manager, talking to ah, Cody grow. <laughs> so much I grow alone if I cook panilara. So I'm a rough people who see dear, 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 come up panilara. But when you set all that in place, eh, you're going to experience growth, dynamic growth, great growth, eh, because everybody is working. And the system is taking its toll. That's what I will help you set up. And then, how do you know completion stage? I to set no, I call So at the end of the day, sir, you will now have what we call a working document, called the manual. So that eh, perhaps you say, okay, I want to go for vacation in UK, in US, three months, and all of that. Everybody follows their manual. It becomes the working Bible for, <laughs> for your organizations, for fish, for whatever, and all of that. And that's how organizations and companies, institutions grow. Eh? That's how yes, people sir. like Dangote, they grow. It's not that he has all the knowledge. He will hire professors and pay them. They work for him, eh? generate money, for him and all of that. So that is momentum for you, sir. What does what does uh, I understand concepts? That is uh, yes. what is the what I, do I want to do? Uh, the, the, the original the idea for the, starting it. 
Yes. Uh -huh. Then I understand uh, construction. That is, I plan for it. You plan for it, yes, deliberately. Yes. Yeah. Then, but what, is, what one is continuity? The first one is a concept. The second one is construction. How you want to go about it. Yes. The third one, what? like I told you, is communication. How do we communicate okay. this? Between okay. leaders, colleagues, and subordinates. No, you are too high. You concentrate on. Hello, 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 sir. Yeah, the 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 thing, the, 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 the communication. We stress it out. How do we communicate? Verbal. Hey, Hello? Report. Okay. Okay, Lama, put it to places, please. Report writing, feedback. Hello? Answer. Yeah, Moni, what does, what constitute communication? Communication, the method of conversation. Report writing. Eh? Yes, sir. And then who reports to who? Across the cluster of superior, colleague, and then subordinate. Look where let my stress out. So that our two tell you can that's here, need that's it. And come manager located. We manager. Give me report. Is manager that would be talking to messenger and laborer who see to And then you can save time. And concentrate okay. on heavier matters. Managers are working, they are making money for you. And they are making their salaries as well. Okay. So that's communication. We build it in such a way that. Everybody, I'm on control. You can't share it, but you can So that anywhere the last is by my wa, and many take me. Okay. That's what we call okay. seamless communication. Okay. Mm? Okay. And yeah, yeah. That, that communication is continuity. How yeah. Before you go, sorry, sir. Yes, sir. Before yes, sir. you go to continuity. Yes, sir. Co communication. One of the things that I have difficulty with is reading reports. Mm. I'm not good. I would solve it for you. Yes, okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Go on, sir. Good. Sherry, when you have difficulty in reading report, you ask, you designate it to a manager who all his work is to summarize the report and come and feed you. So your manager, oh yeah, come and tell me. Do you know president, for example, is supposed to know everything that is happening in the country. So what happened? He has a special essay. Eh? Who will summarize everything and tell him? So it has solution. You are not supposed to read all report. Eh? You have a manager in charge whose work is oh yeah, summarize. It can take a whole report of 36 pages and tell you in three minutes and say, okay, oh so, 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 and so is what they did, and this and that, and this is what they have achieved. So you are not okay. the one who should sit down and read all reports, especially when it's becoming big, when the organization is becoming wide. Okay. Yeah. So, Baba oh, same plan is stage by stage. Last year, Mama, I identify and what problems, challenges that can hamper continuity and also solve it. Just like you are saying this now. We now know which manager is best proficient to read the report and summarize it in few words. So if you a whole document of uh, three bundles of books, under 10 minutes, you have known everything. So 
don't uh, see challenges at things that will deter you from doing it. Oh, my friend Nira at the beginning, but because I will support you to doing it. And once you get it, oh, my dofeni, and your okay. companies will be thriving and growing. And you'll be yeah. making a success of it. Yeah. So, so that's continuity. what communication talks about. Okay. What is continuity? That? Continuity. Continuity. Just like you just expressed to me now, that reading report is difficult for you. Continuity talks about what are the resources on grant and the resourcefulness that will make the procedure to keep on working. Like raw materials. You know that, okay, 500 Lomato, 1,000 Lomato, we make it available. Okay, you arrange it down. And then what are the lapses? What are the problems they are likely to encounter? Continuity will solve it. So you at manager level new, at worker level new, we already have seen it. And then we are making provision for it. That's continuity. And then continuity is a phase that looks into even concept construction and everything. To say, ha, the way we are going, we may not be able to meet our completion target. So each of them, as your work grows, we have managers. You have continuity manager, comprehension manager, as the work grows. But you about it grow, you can put maybe one person on that TV. So you you can do that. So continuity has to do with the human beings and the material procedures by which order and decorum can work. Under continuity, you can even put sanction and reward. Okay, it's a department under continuity. Anybody who does work, carry a hit. Who does work, he gets rewarded. So as to be motivated. People who flouted through, they get sanction. It's a part of continuity. You put order in place, you put systems, you put structure. It's still part of continuity. Show you any sir. Yes, sir. And then which other one you don't understand? I know, yeah. Then completion is the last okay. one. Completion, yes. Completion talks about setting targets to so say. Okay, we want to finish it by middle of June. And you put the target. As you put target, then you designate it. You delegate it. Let the person talk. Who will handle it? What are the things that will make him not to meet target? He will speak up. And then, and then how is that target going to be? What are you expecting to see that you will say completion? You will know, they will know. And at the end of the day, we see that our desire on grand. So go by Lama Kokale. I hear everybody finish, finish. And then momentum will just take its course. And you'll be shocked the result you will get. Instead of just adding a, 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 a outcome, you will multiply results and multiply outcome because every hand is on deck and we know what we want to achieve. That's how big organizations set targets and they meet it. Banks, that's how they set targets. Go see Toko MD, Pelu won't tell her or no tell her. Go see Toko. It will just go and hook head of operation, a bank manager. <laughs> He may not even talk to bank manager. I will talk to GM and rebuke GM for what a bank manager uh, uh, did not even know about. To just quit telling the locals. But MD will not come to the level of teller. 
the way you are doing. So where all these kind of things are in order, then you can easily complete things and get things done. So I said, momentum is what? A conception, implementation, execution, and completion based on what? A priori expectation, appropriate expectation. And it is those stages that get you to that level. It is generating the energy you need to spend on certain people in order to make them act in tandem with what? Protocols. This is a situation where everybody knows what to do and they are doing it. A position where people are in a hurry to get results because they know when they get results, there's reward for them. And they know what obtains. Whoever flouts it, there is sanction. Okay? That is already waiting for them. Hmm? All of those things. It is setting order in place for both machines and machinery to coordinate and orchestrate. It is like leading an orchestra for fit, function, and finesse. A multi orchestra. What's a man prepare a book where? Want to call in? A call in quick book won't come flow me. And when you are part of war, eh? Because it's an orchestra. They orchestrated it. They plan it. They had the expectation. They know where the error can be and they have made provision for it. Glory to this event. So that is how it works. So it is self regulation. Sir? Okay. Go on, go on, go on. So it is self, a self regulating structure on ground running according to plans and objectives where it is a going, a glowing, and a growing according to set targets, irrespective of the hurdles on the way. That you are following momentum does not mean there are no hurdles, but you, you are quick to identify it and to spot it in order to solve it. That is momentum. You identify hurdles, you fix it, you do the needful, and you get it sorted because you know what you are doing and you are doing what you know. Now, these are the enemies of momentum. Is there anyone, you, is there anyone you don't understand? Uh, uh, okay. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm see. I'm getting you. I'm following you thus far. Uh, you said this is the problem of, of momentum. The problem of momentum. Yes. Those are the enemies. What momentum. are they? Okay. Can you see my slide? Ah, uh, my eyes is so good. Okay, I understand. Give me. I'm aware of sleep. Okay, give me five minutes. Let me enter the house. Okay. Oh, hey, what? Well, can I? Hello. Yes. Hello, sir. Um, can I ask a question while you are entering? Yes, ask. Now, the the uh. uh before we look at the problem of uh, momentum, the, yeah. the, for, for me, who is having an existing organization in which I didn't take care of this particular, all these factors all yes. along? Yes. How do I, how do I undo it? Very simple. You engage me, I will now be asking you, oh yeah, give me so, 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 and so. How far have you gone about so, 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 and so? When you tell me, I will now rework it and install those procedures. Okay. That's how to go about it. Okay. 
Okay. All these stages I told you, I will now say, yeah, Mr. Luranti, tell me about your concept. Tell me about this. I will now manufacture and build it into structure for you and into system. So that I become a working implement in your organization. There are 10 enemies of momentum. One. Okay. Planlessness. Sorry, sorry, sir. Okay, one. Planlessness. Planlessness. When you fail to plan. Okay. And you just say, well, we are praying and you are expecting God to bless it when there's no plan on grant. It doesn't okay. work that way. Okay. So prayer is good, but you have to plan yes. and then play the role. You plan and you pray, you plan and then do what? Play yes. the roles. Three P. Pray, plan, play. So planlessness is an enemy. Okay. Two, distortion. And what can cause distortion? To plan and not follow it. Oh, yeah. You are breaking it. You, the leader who set it, is also the leader who is breaking it. It will work. So let's not distort what is on ground. When you are okay. a leader, keep it. Others will join you to keep it. Okay. How is that? Hello? Okay. Hello. Hello. Hello? So the second enemy of momentum, like I said, is distortions. When we break rules because of people and because of sentiment, their momentum will be momentarily affected. Then the third one is systemic absence. No system in place. Information will be so bulky and so half -assed. You can even plan to do some certain things that can request ah, me, they're not taking you. Because 
for many things are concentrated on you as a person. That is it. Then number four, inability to recognize resources will kill momentum. And when you don't recognize resources, responsibility will be worked. Things will mm -hmm. not follow order. Eh? Resources inability to recognize resources whether human or even material is an enemy of momentum and people will be looking at you and yet you are paying them <laughs> for what you are doing <laughs> you are the one doing it too and yet they are any money for what you are doing for them Then lack of resourcefulness is an enemy of momentum. No, no sorry, that number, this number reduce four. your stuff. Uh, sorry, that no, number, number four. One. Number four, number inability, four. inability to recognize resources. And what do you mean by inability to recognize resources? Yes, human resources are resources. Material resources are resources. Where there is no momentum, you alone can be doing the work. And people you employ to do it, one, will either be sidelined or they are not trained to do it. And then the potential in them, you may not even discover it. And then they will hide it. But when momentum is at work, people on their own will bring out their talent, their skills, and everything, and add it up. They will want to win. So you are not able to recognize those resources and put them to use. And then work will overlap. You see two people doing almost the same thing. And where you should get somebody to do two things. You may actually get two people to be doing those two things where one person is enough. Because there's no momentum. And then number five, five. lack of resourcefulness. Where you are not trained, like I'm training you now. What you don't know, sir, you cannot use. Even when we pray, it will take a knowing. So that's why from time to time, if you hire us, we'll be looking into your works. We'll be seeing what face you are part time. No matter how voluminous are your st streams of businesses, we'll be putting an eye on it and saying, Mr. Lurati, how far with this? Can you want so? What are they saying? Are they aware they are delivering at so so time? What problems are they encountering? By the time people know that the system and the management is upon them, they will deliver. Yeah. Another challenge and enemy of momentum is failure of responsibility. Responsibility fails. Where responsibilities are collapsing, that is where momentum stops. And like I told you, there's no way you can do the job of everybody or oversee everybody. No. You set systems and structure in place. You, know what? You. you set up systems and structure in place. Failure of responsibility. Okay. When people fail to deliver their responsibility, it kills momentum. It can be tiny responsibility to say, okay, uh, my kidney is just a small organ. It will stop the whole body. Uh, oh, appendix. Nobody sees it, it's inside. And it has problem. It can stop the whole system from working. 
And then when another problem is when there's no feedback mechanism in place, no feedback. People just do because they are told to do. Where is the monitoring and evaluation? Where it is not, then we don't get what we should get, when we should get it. And that's another problem. Then number, is it number eight. seven? Number eight now. When there's no filing, no flow. Nobody is filing in anything. Nobody is creating a flow. So momentum will stop. What is filing? Uh, filing, write report, show oh, okay. what has happened. File okay. things out. Who is keeping record? How far so far? No department is filing in. Leaders and managers are not filing in. Then how do we ensure that it's done? It's not just word of mouth. Oh, Atisha, we need the record on grant. Then number nine, impulsive decisions. To just decide something without looking at the bigger picture. Can be injurious to momentum. That's why momentum is what you set before you even begin it. Eh? Impulsive decision like just buying something because it's cheap, not because you need it to say, ah, this thing is cheap, you just buy it. And at the end of the day, it becomes a waste and you incur costs to even store it and you discover you don't need it. Okay. So impulsive decisions. And lastly, wrong intentions lead to bad destinations. Oh, I'm going to sack that man. Why are you sacking him? Oh, he didn't greet me well. Oh, I don't like his character. Can we work on his character? Have we looked at his charisma? Do we run SWOT analysis? I help people to grow along the walk. These are few out of many enemies of momentum. Okay. Then of activity. Hyperactivity within a person. Just doing it alone. Inadequate training, it's another one. You employ people, you didn't give them training and induction. It's not even enough to train them both. We must carry out induction program so that they will fit into what they are going to do in a perfect fit. It will keep momentum. Then when an organization does not have a corporate mentoring mentality. For example, now in time we come, every month, we will run a corporate mentoring for everybody, including you, sir. Just like I am doing for Plummet Mission now. You won't believe the report we are getting. Since I left Igbesa, every month, I'm running corporate mentoring for Baba, Mama, all the team members and uh, executives. And we're getting results. <laughs> so it's not too much to fix one. Every month. Of mentoring what? Absence of corporate mentoring. The organizations should have corporate mentoring. Not just you. Just like I'm doing for Plummet Mission. Every month on Zoom, I mentor Baba, every critical leadership or plummet mission. I teach them some certain things. They tell me issues. I package it into equipping, just like I'm doing for you now. If you can make it a monthly thing, 
and expose your leadership to it, your work will grow. You will gain speed. Okay. okay. Then another one, no team. Absence of team. Winning team. To team up. When we don't operate in teams and we operate individually, it will impact on momentum. Lack of strategic drives. Nobody is driving anything except the leader. It's an enemy of momentum. And then where vision and mission statement are unclear, people are just working. They don't know the vision. They don't know what the leader saw for a concept, overfishing. They don't know his, his construction, over bookshop. That's why the last person you get will just crash the thing down. <laughs> because he's not aware why you are doing it. He just thought you want to make extra money. And he crashes it down. There must be clear cut vision. There must be understanding mission statement. There must be corporate objectives. And then there must be core Hello. values. In strategic drives, we are looking at four things. One, vision statement. I say, Mr. Luranti, what is your vision statement about your businesses? We may not have. If we have, okay. it's only known to you and your wife. Your staff may not know it. Then I have a mission statement. Vision says, what can you see? Vision says, how do you get there? Then what are your corporate objectives? Do we have? And then the core values that power this oh, objective. Hello? Hello, sir. Hello? Yeah, you say uh, there, are, there are four things about a strategic drive. Yes. One is vision. OK. What are we seeing? And are the people seeing it the way we are seeing it? Two is mission. How do we arrive there at what we are seeing? That's mission. Three. Sorry, corporate. Sir. Sorry, sir. Yes, sir. You have a question? No, you say mission is how to achieve how to get there, how to arrive at what we are seeing. Then number three is corporate objectives. Talks about why. Why are we doing all this? What do we want to attain? You to draw them down. And then number four is core values. What are the character, the attitude we need to be able to drive these three? It's called core values. Where is our sense of importance? We value integrity, we value transparency, you value industry, then all those things will come in. So that anybody who come to work with you, see all this, he will say, wow, this is an institution. This is an organization. And then they will be able to simplify it. When there is no incentive, it kills momentum. Where there are no organograms, 
People don't know who to report to. No reporting line. Equals. Yeah. I'm coming. I'm here, I'm coming. So finally. Okay. Then. And the absence of periodic auditing. Nobody is auditing anything. Can also be an issue. Absence of audit. What are we to audit? Process, people, performance, projects. You audit them. Audit the managers. Audit performance. Audit the people. Very vital. Okay. So how do we what do we how do what do we do next now? <laughs> And then see, score yourself, your various businesses in their light. See what I frame down for you as per what we, we do next. The need for procedural re-engineering in your businesses. What is it? Where? Why? How and the impact. So I will send you the Google link so that you can replay this thing to yourself and then put things down for every area of your businesses and see how far you are feared over the seas of momentum from concept to completion. From there, I will say, Mr. Luranti. Oh yeah, let's see the ground running. Let's start like this, let's start like that. Okay. Now you have a better perspective of what okay. is stopping your momentum and okay. how you have not put momentum in place. Okay. So let's stop here today, sir. Thank you very much, thank you, sir. I so hope you are able to get something. Very much. <laughs> you said you said something about uh, uh, you know that when you when I was hello sir hello eh uh, kilesa you say you will eventually train me to to be able to train to be able to uh, coach others too. Yes. That's what we have started now. Okay. I'm invariably training you now to see the bigger picture of who you are and what you are supposed to do. Yeah. Uh -huh. But if you want me to mentor you and train you as a leader, then you can tell me the areas you want besides just raising your businesses. I can create okay. another package entirely for you and send it to you if you want that one. I'll send it to you tomorrow. Okay. Yeah, but it will be good for me to uh, be able to, yeah, to what one thing we have discussed before that is uh, apparent is that by the time we work out all of these things, then we yes, can sir. now go into the phase where implementation, you will get involved in the implementation. No problem. No problem, sir. But I need to carry you along, just like I am doing now, so that you can understand the nitty gritty. And when I'm implementing, you will see that, yes, it is your dream I'm implementing, not my own. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you very and much. You got any nice you. evening, sir. Thank you, sir. So I will send this uh, video to you. And then you can hear it and make some notes and apply it. And then I'll send you some courses I feel 
I can mentor you on and, and coach you to be able to do for others. Okay. Have a nice evening, sir. Thank you, Good night.